welcome back to Delphia's Fitness and Health Family. Today we'll be talking about health benefits of mango leaves and why you should drink mango leaf tea. Some of the health benefits are it helps to prevent stomach ache. It is good in dissolving gall and kidney stones. It's good for respiratory problem. It relieves ear ache. It's good for hiccups. It heals bones, dysentery. It helps with restlessness, lowers blood pressure, and regulates diabetes. There is even more health benefits, and we're going to get right into all of that. But I noticed that from the previous videos I did, most of you, my viewers, are new to my channel, so you are welcome. Please, if you're watching, drop a comment so I can welcome you properly, and don't forget to subscribe, turn on notification, so you can join the Fierce Fitness family let's get right into this video okay so i know that a lot of people know the health benefits of eating mangoes but not so many persons know the health benefits of consuming mango leaf tea or using it in different ways because there are different ways you can actually use the mango leaf it can be grounded and more but we will discuss all of that toward the end of the video let me just give you more reason to consume your mango leaf tea so mango leaf teas are good for all kinds of respiratory problems it is it is especially useful for people that are suffering from cold bronchitis and asthma drinking this concussion will actually help you a lot. So one might want to ask, how do I go about it? If you have a mango tree close by you, then you're already one step ahead of people that don't have it. Get some mango leaves, wash them properly. Some people at this, at this step, some people love to put it out to dry a little bit and then use it, but you can still just pluck your mango leaves, wash them properly, put them in a the pot, add some cup of water, to the amount that you feel is okay for you and then boil it let it sit sieve and then add a little bit of honey and then drink it but some people will not want to add honey because maybe you don't like honey or whatnot if you are used to drinking tea without adding anything at all no sugar no sweetener no honey nothing you can actually drink your mango tea straight up but honey is also very healthy and has its own health benefiting properties. So it is always good. It's a plus adding that to your mango tea. So it is also good in curing voice loss. Some people suffer from that also. So drink your mango tea and come back later to let me know what you think. So some more health benefits of mango leaves are it helps to support your skin health. So you want that perfect, beautiful and glowing skin and you don't want to apply all those products that have chemicals. You should look uh, towards using natural remedies to achieve that beautiful skin because you already have all those stuffs in nature. OK, so mango leaves is one of them. Get your mango leaves, boil them and consume them as tea okay so one more health benefit is it is excellent for hair problems so if you're having hair loss any type of hair problem mango tea is where you should go to okay because you have your mango leaf you can boil it and you can actually use the water in many different form either you're drinking it as tea or you're using it uh for your hair or whatnot okay so mango uh leaf also helps to balance blood sugar isn't that good balancing blood sugar okay mango leaf will also help to manage high blood pressure mango leaf also treats gall and kidney stones mango leaf may treat stomach ulcer and hiccups yeah hiccups can be very uncomfortable okay stomach ulcer also so consume your mango tea and get a better result mango uh, mango leaves may help with weight loss a lot of people battle with weight loss and this is a natural way to go about it i have mentioned several other herbs that can also help with weight loss also mango leaves uh, may help with um, 
inflammation so if you're suffering from inflammation mango leaves may help with that because mango leaves actually have anti-inflammatory properties in them so that is going to help you with inflammation and various type of inflammation so continue consuming your mango leaf not only consuming mango fruits but also look at the leaves because it has many health benefits okay so pre previously i have pre pre um, explained how to prepare your mango leaf tea but i was talking about people that have mango leaf available either you have a mango tree or you have your neighbor or someone around you you can go ask a few leaves but if even if you don't they sell and you can purchase online uh if you can walk to the store then you know a store where they sell it you can go get it and also they also sell mango leaves in powder form some people dry it blend it and then it's in powder form they package it and they sell it you can also buy that that is also going to be good you boil your water add it in let it sit for a little bit and then you sieve it out get a clean tea with no shaft or whatnot in in it and add a little bit of honey and drink it i prefer you use honey don't use any other type of sweetener use honey because of the health health uh, properties that is in honey so it is also going to add to the health benefits that the mango leaf is going to give to you so that's a plus plus for you and it's a plus plus for your health health is wealth as we know it let's continue so if you've watched the video to this point let me know did you know how useful mango leaves uh where or this is the first time you're actually hearing about it or have you heard about it but you've been skeptical thinking that that's not true i quickly want to add uh, a short story here personally in africa this is something we use so it's a tea that i have personally consumed myself because sometimes people feel like you share these things but you've never tried it there is this particular uh concussion if you will call it that we make and it and it consists of a whole lot of leaves like the mango leaves and so many more the lemongrass all combined together boiled in a giant pot and anybody people from the whole community and the next community can come it treats different illnesses and i remember when my auntie would always make it even when she's not around, people will travel very far just to go get this from her. And I will watch her as a, as a little girl growing. I will follow her around where she goes to collect all these leaves. And I still remember most of them, but there are so, so many that I cannot remember all of them at this point. But as, as many as I can remember, I will share with you. And trust me, it is very, very good. Okay, so let's continue health benefits some more health benefits of mango leaf it heals bones so if you have bones you can actually use it to treat the bones it is good to uh if you want to treat dysentery you know how uncomfortable dysentery can be mango leaves are a good way to get rid of dysentery mango leaf treats restlessness so if you know someone around you that is very that is really restless or uh, the person is showing signs of restlessness we know what that is all about. it's about stress anxiety and whatnot get the person to consume mango tea it's not going to it's not a difficult tea to prepare it's not a difficult mango leaves are not that difficult to find but if it's difficult in your area please go online and see it, where you can order where you can purchase i don't think it would be that expensive and then prepare it for that person to get rid of restlessness. It helps uh, to regulate lower blood. Uh, it, sorry, it helps with um, blood pressure level. Okay, it helps to regulate blood pressure level. It helps to relieve hiccups. Hiccups are very uncomfortable. It helps to relieve ear infections. So if you have ear infections, it will help you with that also. Uh uh, mango leaves also will help with the respiratory problem. I think I mentioned that earlier. Uh, it's also good in preventing various stomach uh, ailments so because, you know, there's so many things that can contribute to different stomach upsets and pains and whatnot. It is good for that. And it is also good in dissolving gallstone and kidney stone. And it is also very good in regulating blood sugar level. Now, let me know in the comment section 
if you're going to be making your mango tea but first of all one thing i want to point out make sure that the mango three you're trying to collect leaf from is not that that is not one that is sprayed because i know a whole lot of people spray in africa we don't always spray our plants uh but i noticed here in europe for example they spray a lot so wherever you're based make sure the plant you want to collect from is not sprayed and remember to always wash every leaf properly before you proceed to use them thank you so very much subscribe and i will see you in the next video